Namaste. And welcome back to Grow with the Jan family. I am JD. And I'm Anjali. And today we're going to be watching Dr. Uma Madusadan, um, a Mysore original doctor honored in front of her house in recognition of her extraordinary service treating coronavirus patients um, mm -hmm. here in Connecticut. Um, yeah. Just amazing. It's nice to see that people are doing this you know you can't be close and keep your bubble your Lakshmi Reka mm -hmm. around um, and keep your distance but she has I'm assuming putting extraordinary hours not only is she working with the coronavirus patients which puts her at risk you know these doctors are now becoming like soldiers they can yeah. mm -hmm. they're putting their lives on the line to save other to people. Save all these other well, people. Well, they know they could die too. They could get it and they could die too from it. Mm -hmm. We've heard stories of, of doctors and nurses that have lost their lives um, being a hero and trying to treat as many of these patients as they can. Um, mm -hmm. and, and we also hear, you know, not everything is perfect. Not everybody has enough masks or supplies to treat, but. Um, you guys that are out there that are doing the best you can and putting your life on the line, this is the kind of stuff we love to see. Um, you know, she's from Mysore originally, India, and you know, living here. And these are the type of, you know, people we, we love to see here. Yeah. You know, hardworking. She puts her life on the line. And, you know, normally doctors do all they can for you anyways. But... You know, At she probably time, has a family of her own and she's out there working, you know, where she knows that she mm -hmm. could also get it herself. So, you know, we salute her and mm -hmm. everybody else that's on the front lines, um, you know, during this time. So it's not over, but it's nice to see people doing what they can to recognize um, people that are putting out these services when the rest of us are at home. So let's yeah. watch it. Mm -hmm. so they're keeping their social distance. And they made signs for her. Like that's so yeah. There's like so many cars going by too. Hi, Anita. This was amazing. The mm -hmm. amount of cars and people that showed up to do that for her. Mm -hmm. um, just unbelievable. It makes me so proud. And that she was outside for them to see them and blowing kisses and waving. Um, just amazing. Yeah, and all the doctors who are working during this coronavirus de deserve mm -hmm. this and so much more because they yeah. are they're out there risking their lives to save other people who are sick. And the people that are out there not taking this seriously, think about, like, how the doctors feel. Like, you're not taking this seriously. Think about the doctors feel, how they're risking their lives out every to day. save someone else every day. Yeah. So this is serious. Like, yes. this is not a joke. We've talked about it in the last couple of videos. This is serious. 
yeah. you're in lockdown mm-hmm. for a reason. You wear masks if you go outside. Social distance if you have to be outside. But these people, this wonderful doctor, I mean, just makes me so proud to see. She deserves this, like you said, and the nurses and the other doctors out there that are just risking their lives every single day. And people need to take this seriously so that there aren't more and more patients that end up at the doctor's office, that end up at the hospital, or that end up in a body bag outside the hospital because there's no room. So take this seriously. But yes, this was amazing and she deserves every honk and wave and balloon and thank you and so much more so mm-hmm. what did you like Jaden? i like that the fire trucks and the police came by to like celebrate mm-hmm. and they too are ones out there start yeah. risking their mm-hmm. lives right if somebody needs something they are not thinking twice you know kind of reminds me of soldiers a little bit like Mm -hmm. putting their lives on the line this Mm -hmm. is a different type of war this is like a it's a coronavirus war biological warfare almost like Mm -hmm. it's not like the great depression when we had world war ii it's it's different it's like silent bullets you don't see Mm -hmm. you can't see and these doctors and nurses and the police and the firemen, everybody who's out there risking their life every day, trying to save mm-hmm. people, you know, they, you guys deserve, you know, a clap, pat on the back, and so much more because yeah. you really are risking your lives. Um, you know, we're going to do some more videos. Our kind of main purpose is kind of to update you on how we're doing here in the U.S. and give you guys some some feedback on how it's been here because it's starting to come to India and we want you guys to be safe. Mm-hmm. We don't want things to get bad there because it could get really bad if it does. Mm-hmm. So please listen to Modi's seven things that he talked about points yeah. and stay inside, stay safe. Um, so it doesn't spread. Um, we're going to try to do some other videos about China and how, how much it's responsible for all this. It's gone around the world and it started in Wuhan. So we'll talk about that too. We'll mm-hmm. show you a little bit about, you know, homeschooling and things we've been doing at home. And of course we will eventually, um, bring in some movies and songs and stuff mm-hmm. too. So you guys can keep sending us comments about things you want to see, but our main focus is to let you know about this stuff and, this doctor we thank her for her service Mm -hmm. and she did an amazing job so we need more people like her here um in the u.s so Mm -hmm. i hope you guys like this and don't don't forget forget to subscribe subscribe. and click that notification bell down below because you're gonna like it when youtube shares our videos and join the wonderful jan family and hopefully we'll see you tomorrow. tomorrow bye